What's good superstars, back with another video and today I'm going to be doing the IKEA PAX wardrobe system like I promised. I'm starting it today, I don't know if I'll finish it today. Again, I don't have every single part that I need, but going to start it, try it out. We'll see how it goes, show you the process. There's probably gonna be a couple videos on this just to put everything together, but uh, let's go look, take a look what we're working with right now. All right, so this is what we're working with. You might have seen it before. Um, trying to use a new camera here, so it's kind of hard to aim it, but there's all our stuff. Pretty much, uh, it's gonna be a disaster. You got our TV box in the corner there too, but uh, looking forward to doing this. I think it'll be pretty fun. This part won't be fun, cleaning out this room here, all Mel's stuff on the floor there. Uh, and then we're basically gonna go from this wall to that wall, uh, one wardrobe and then this wall to the, about the door area with the other wardrobe and uh, pretty much hopefully it'll dampen some of the echo in this room not the biggest room but, uh, but yeah that's uh, pretty much what we're dealing with I'm gonna try and set this up on like some kind of a time lapse or something like that I've never done one before so hopefully this works out and we put some nice groovy tunes to the building process and let's uh, go from there. I want to show you guys how far I've gotten so far. Basically, we have six pieces and I have installed, as you can see, one's right here, but I have installed six frames. So there's two on this side, I'm gonna put another one there because you got the door and I uh, wanted the doors to be able to open. So we put, we're gonna do three on each side, but instead we got four on this side, right there. A little hard to see from this angle, but yeah, four on that side. The entire wall pretty much is gonna be closet. And then we got two on this side. As you can see, the window's right there. So you're gonna have some nice light, maybe we'll put like a little, table or something there for uh, sitting down or a stool or something. Um, yeah, so that's that room. We still got a disaster going on in here, but uh, slowly gonna throw all that out. It's uh, it's crazy times, but you know, quarantine, gotta be uh, keeping busy and uh, that's what we're doing in here. So that's uh, what we have so far. I'm gonna try and put some of the drawers in. Like I said, we don't have all the pieces for everything yet because uh, Ikea sold out a bunch of stuff. But right now we got like the major frames and I think we got the drawers and they got like some rods, some shoe racks, I don't know, whatever they had in stock I bought before the quarantine and uh, now I'm getting around to it. So hopefully by the end of this vlog, you'll see what exactly I had and what I bought and then going forward, I'll order some more stuff online and then put it all together and then show you a final maybe in a future vlog. But guys, let's keep going with the day and uh, see what's going on. Took out some meats, uh, we got some steaks, a little bit of uh, leftover ground turkey. We're gonna try and make like a patty out of that. Uh, just letting that defrost, probably gonna have a nice uh, barbecue and uh, maybe make some lettuce wraps with that. Uh, and my next task is going to be cleaning out the fridge. Yeah, so the fridge is a disaster. I mean, uh, we have a bunch of stuff in there. I wanna make sure we uh, don't let it get wasted. So once I go through that, there's this app that I found on my phone. I don't even remember what it's called. It tells you how much is in your fridge, what you have, so that when you're at the grocery store, you know what's left, what's gonna expire, or whatnot. So that's what I'm gonna plan on doing maybe for the next hour. I got a workout today too, do like an indoor workout. Uh, P90X version three I've been doing. Uh, it's been helping, but uh, eating the chocolates at night has not been helping. And uh, Mel's gonna be by soon. We're gonna probably make some of her juices again. Uh, not much goes on on these days, but uh, I'll show you as much as we can. I try and do one of these a week or something like that. So let's see, uh, maybe I'll update you on how it goes with the fridge. I just uh, looked it up. The app is called No Waste. And like I said, you can do it for your pantry, for your fridge, and I think for your freezer or something like that. And you just put everything that you have. And it even, I think, gives you dates on like when things typically expire. So like, for example, it'll be like broccoli will expire in a week or something like that. Uh, and as you can see, we got this huge, a uh, bit of hair. Definitely have had no haircuts. I've not shaved the beard at all since quarantine started and uh, don't plan on doing it. 
until we hit 500 subscribers. So if you're not subscribed and you want to see me cut my own hair, click down there and uh, subscribe because why not subscribe when uh, you can watch somebody cut their own hair. Uh, besides that, I'm going to go, like I said, do the fridge and when I come back, maybe I'll explain how it went. Maybe I'll try and take some screenshots or something like that, show you what's in the fridge, but uh, we'll go from there. This is going to take quite a bit, I think. Uh, I'm not looking forward to it. And guys, it's the next day. I finally finished organizing the fridge here. I wrote down everything in that app. We're gonna see how it goes. I think it's gonna be kind of hectic to keep up with, but just wanted to try it out to uh, see if it makes it easier when you go shopping at the store. I'll keep you guys updated on that, tracking your fridge, pantry, that type of thing. Right now I'm only doing the fridge. Just wanna see, because that stuff tends to expire a little bit quicker. Uh, I wanna see how it helps. Uh, and if the app makes sense, uh, I always thought it was a good idea and then I found one and hopefully it worked. But uh, guys, I'm going to show you inside the fridge what I did here. Alright, so you open the fridge and I did a lot of research when it came to uh, how to organize your fridge. As you can see, it's pretty organized. I've got uh, some of uh, Mel's organic stuff on this side. As you can tell, it's pretty empty because that stuff expires really quick. Uh, we got condiments down here, some whipped cream from some of our videos. Got some protein shakes and uh, some diet sodas just for ease of access. And then we got some more up here. Uh, this one here is a new one that we're trying out. It's called uh, Aha Sparkling Water. It's got like absolutely nothing in it. Mel loves it. Zero calories, obviously, for all of these. Uh, protein shakes are a pretty good source of protein, 30 grams of protein. Uh, so then we have like a little bit of alcohol that uh, we really don't touch. And uh, just in case if people were to come over uh, after COVID's done, we got some San Pellegrino, Mel likes her, her bubbly water. We got uh, berries, those are gonna go soon. Then we got a bunch of lettuce heads. We did lettuce wraps yesterday. Uh, I got some mint and then uh, I got some leftovers up here. This is from yesterday. We had a salad and uh, some leftover steak and turkey. Um, then this, this is like a bunch of Mel's stuff she was using for juicing. So we got like kale and uh, cabbage over here, spinach and uh, dandelions, all kind of uh, grass things. Uh, down here, bottom drawer, we got a bunch more stuff that she uses for juicing. I mean, fennel, carrots, cucumbers, we even throw them in salads. Here you got celery. If you're wondering why there's no celery at the stores, it's because it's all in our fridge. And then here we just got like a couple things I like to eat, some cheese, some sausage, some uh, tarales, which is like an Italian uh, bread and uh, a little bit of chili pepper that I was using yesterday Then we got again uh, some more vegetables. We got peppers in here. We got mushrooms. We got olives Mel likes her beets and uh, onions get those away from me. Hold on. I, gotta close that. I hate onions and uh, a bunch of apples again Mel brought one nuts for, for the juicing I uh, got some oranges and uh, a couple half limes and uh, This is another reason why I wanted to do that uh, tracking thing in my app because I want to make sure that like I'm not throwing out stuff that I don't have to throw out But yeah overall fridge looks good. I mean who knows how long it's gonna look like this because We're gonna have uh, Mel coming in here and stor storming through it, but uh, overall guys That's pretty organized. You gotta admit it. I don't got like any special Storage tools. I like that this area is like a leftovers area. This is like some drinks, but uh, ease of access Even if I just had drinks here and then we can even use that shelf for uh, a little bit of overflow but yeah, I gotta do the freezer still, but that's another day. This already took forever. And uh, guys, I'm gonna go show you now the progress that I made yesterday on the shelving upstairs. Not too much. I uh, ended up slicing my finger pretty nice uh, on one of the drawers. I was trying to do the drawer installation and uh, pretty much those drawers are just as hard as doing the frames. So I only really got one drawer in, but uh, you'll see that right now. Yep, so this is our entryway. We kind of cut it in half just to fit this inside, but I showed you that guys yesterday. And uh, here we go, this is, we showed this already yesterday, that's one side. Basically what we did is we're gonna have half is hers, half is mine, and same thing on this side, but these sides are gonna have drawers. So there's that first drawer. Today I'm probably gonna build one or two more drawers. Uh, kind of a busy day, but I'm just trying to plug a little bit away at a time. And uh, yeah, that's what it looks like when it's out. We're gonna have, I think, three or four on each of them. And uh, if you see these rails in the back, when I was installing them, the edges of them, like, here, underneath, are, like, super sharp, and didn't realize that. 
they got like grease on them too. So like your hand just, my hand just slid across it. And I didn't even realize it at first. And then I looked and I saw it was pretty badly uh, cut. But I like those because like right at the end, if you watch this, like I'll close it. And then right at the end, it'll just like close itself. See that? So that's pretty cool. But yeah, uh, that's been the projects for the last couple of days. And uh, it's been pretty fun. So guys, thank you again for watching. Still have not cut the beard, not cut the hair. You gotta subscribe. If I get the 500 subs, I'm gonna cut my hair myself live on the channel. Make sure that you guys like this video, especially if you like the vlog type because they're easy to make and uh, I feel like I share a little bit more when I do that. Uh, again, let me know how you guys organize your fridge. That'd be cool to know. And if you guys are doing any kind of projects like during this quarantine time. Right now I've been getting pretty, uh, a pretty good amount of work done. Uh, because I haven't been going to the gym as often, obviously, because it's closed. So I've been doing like home workouts, half an hour, P90X, and uh, that's it. So, guys, thank you again for watching. You know what it is. Subscribe, ding the bell. You'll know when I post the next vlog, the next video. My Instagram is booming right now. Go check out my Instagram, at Gretel Superstar. TikTok, at Gretel Superstar. Twitter, at Gretel Superstar. Go check them all out, guys, because that's where I'm posting like a lot of other content. If you do miss the vlogs and or you uh, aren't satisfied with how many are going up, I got more content going up on those avenues, so make sure you check those out, and guys, I love you. Bye.